What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Alicia, coming at you with a cosmetic haul. I went to a couple of drugstores looking specifically for the um, new Maybelline lipsticks and the matte Kate Moss Rimmel um, lipsticks, and I was able to find them, so I wanted to go ahead and haul these drugstore items for you guys. The first store I went to was Target. Target is where I was able to find the um, the new, uh, what are these called? Gosh, the new Maybelline Vivid Lipsticks. The new Maybelline Vivid Lipsticks. And they come in the orange, like a neon orange package. Um, I believe they had like seven colors at my location, but I only was attracted to three. The first one is... 895 on fire red. I'll swatch on fire red for you. You can see that. And I currently am wearing on fire red. It is a pretty bright red, so I toned mine down with the MAC Chestnut Lip Liner um, to kind of tone it down, and I liked it better that way. I'll play around with other ways that I can wear it, but this is on fire red okay the next one which is my favorite is 905 brazen berry it's like a pink with a purple undertone I absolutely love this one okay that's the second one brazen berry the next color is 900 Hot Plum. They do have another pink that's called Vivid Rose that I want to look for. And if I find it, then I'll probably purchase that one. But this is Hot Plum. The pinks are the most prettiest colors in this collection to me. They had some bright oranges and etc. that I just didn't care for um, that much. I have a couple of orange lipsticks that I'm perfectly fine with and you know so I did not get those but of course if you guys are looking for some pretty oranges then you may want to try it. But again this one is Hot Plum and I really like it. Okay. Then I got some of the color tattoos, and from my understanding, these are not limited editions, so I think they will be part of the regular line. This one is called, it's number 75, Electric Blue. It's a really pretty blue base, so I want to see what it looks like when I wear my blue eyeshadows, see if I can make them pop. Okay, that's Electric Blue. The next one is a pretty silver, and it's called Silver Strike. That silver strike. And the third one, I believe it's either five or six that came in the collection, but these were the only ones that I like. They also had like a pinkish color and one other color. I think it's five in the collection. This one is Gold Rush. Okay, so that was my trip to. Target. I'm on the fence totally about this red color. You guys tell me what you think um, and you'll see why later. But then I went grocery shopping for my Christmas dinner items and my local drugstore had the Revlon Colorstay foundation on sale for $8. So I picked up one in Caramel. caramel. I have been dying to try this one and I haven't so since it was on sale I went ahead and bought it. I believe they really would take advantage of the 75% off sale but they really just didn't have much that, that I gravitated towards some of the items that they had. I got last year and I just didn't see anything that I wanted but I was able to get two of these Revlon, um, Revlon fingernail polishes. Got this color. This one is called Black Star. And it's more of a smoke gray to me. Let's see if I can let you guys see that. Can you guys see that? It's more of a smoke gray. I don't know. It's more of a smoky gray color to me. 
so I thought it was really pretty though and this one is called um, graceful a really pretty nude color so I got that one as well and 75% um, off these were like 150 and you know they're like eight um, no I think they're actually like six dollars or so so and I was on the hunt for the new Rimmel London Cake Collection matte lipsticks. I love matte lipsticks and I've been hearing some good things about these so I wanted to try them. They are $5.50 and I treated myself to these because I was going to purchase Candy Yum Yum from MAC since it came out and it's not now part of the regular line and then I was also going to get Rebel. But I figure, why not go ahead and get some of the Kate Rimmel and then some of the Maybelline Vivids and I can get six lipsticks for the price of two, two MAC lipsticks. So that's what I did. These, like I said, were $5.50. So all three of these is almost the price of one MAC lipstick. About $16 bucks, and I think a MAC lipstick is like $14 or $15. So there you go. Um... These were in my local Walgreens, but you guys, I don't think they're out for on display yet. They were at like the top shelves, so um, you guys have to kind of look for them. I got wind of it in the makeup group, Makeup Matters on Facebook. Um, the girls were telling, telling everyone to look up top, and lo and behold, they were up there. Um, I think they have a total of 10 matte lipsticks. I only gravitated to three of them. One of them is being 104, and I'm going to put the uh, Rimmel Kates on this side. It's a it's a pretty matte pale pink. It's like that nude pink that you kind of would love to have. Hope you guys can see that. Okay. And the next two are both red colors. I guess you just can never have too many red lipsticks. And I swear they are both different. And I came home and swatched them with some of the reds that I currently have. Like Russian Red. My favorite um, Milani Berry Rich color. And surprisingly they're all different shades. So this one is 107. One oh seven is here. It's like a really, it's a deep red, and then you can see it compared to one eleven, which is called Kiss of Fire. This is the only one that has the name at the bottom. Interesting. This one is called Kiss of Fire. You see how those two reds are totally different. So, these are the six lipsticks that I purchased. All pink and red tone lipsticks, but I absolutely love all of them. I am totally on the fence about this one. I'm not sure yet. As I stated, I have it on, so you guys can tell me what you think. Yeah. The last item, two items that I got was also from Walgreens. And these are some new simple colors that were also on the top shelf in my Walgreens. They have not been put out for display. Yet the lady said they probably would not put them out until next week because they were trying to get rid of all of the Christmas sale items. But nonetheless, she sold them to me. This one is called Bow Khaki. It's a really kind of khaki mossy green color. Bow Khaki. And the last color is Mesmerizing. And it's a really deep purple color okay um, you guys I will be adding a slide at the end of this video displaying the winner of the Christmas giveaway that I had I do apologize that I have not announced the winner I was supposed to do it Saturday but I have been busy my freaking car engine light came on, so my car is in the shop. You know, it's the devil is really trying to steal my Christmas joy, but I am not going to allow that to happen. 
I will announce the winner at the end of this video, so stay tuned and I appreciate your patience. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. If you have any questions on where to get any of the items, please comment below. I will list all of the products in the description box and until my next video, you guys, deuces.